purpose of Earth Week is to engage people that are typically a little bit alienated from the whole environmental sustainability movement, I guess. And so Earth Fest is the culmination of that, and it's just a celebration of everything we've done this week and a chance for campus community members to interact with Chicago community members and to share great food and color and do all sorts of fun things and just to celebrate the Earth. I'm here because I started a group uh, with my friend Natalie called Green Greeks. Um, what we do is we go to fraternities the um, morning or the day after parties and collect recyclables um, because otherwise they would just be going straight into the trash. Um, and so from that um, from that interest, I've become somewhat involved with like GCI and, and the Earth Week planning. I am here to the yard. What I'm doing is I'm feeding it out from a roving because the dairy has a farm. And from the roving, I am putting into a single ply of yarn, which is about a quarter of yarn. This is a fingering weight yarn that's good for maybe five sacks, making shawls, things like that. One success that we had this year was working with a lot of different groups. So we worked with Q&A and we worked with UC Dems. Um, well, we're, we're throwing a sustainable frat party. I'm going to be there talking about recycling and it's just going to be free food and everybody hanging out and just like being there and being excited about the earth while being in a fraternity, which like I think is great. I went to a tree in earlier in the week where we basically went on a tour of all the different trees and um, on campus and it was really cool and there's this competition where if you adopt a tree and um, like informally and kind of just take care of it and learn about it and write poetry to it, there's a little collaborative competition that you can enter through the Civic Knowledge Project. University is doing a lot to talk about the use of natural resources um, and one of the, the great things about composting is in general is that our system is not set up to really handle what we know as organic matter whether it be grass clippings, plant cl clippings, all the way down to the food scraps. The leftovers of your meal are something that um, has a lot of really important nutrients that we want to be returning to the soil, returning to our systems rather than locking up in plastic bags typically and putting them in a landfill where they're not going to be utilized. I think it's really great that this fair is here because you know it's not every day when people think about you know go trailers at uh, dining halls or you know let's try to buy organic. It really gets students thinking about this type of thing. Like perks some of and says like oh right you know this is something I should be thinking about this is something real this is something that is like right here um, and I'm really excited that we have such a great spread here right on the quads just um, you can't go to class today without without noticing it and without hopefully stopping by and to see what it's all, it's all about. Yeah, I think that generally educating people about what they can do or what could be done changes the way people think about things and getting the ideas out there is a big part of that. Go green!